Well, not long after the shooting at the high school, federal agents, along with local police, went to the neighborhood where relatives of the alleged shooter live. Our crews found investigators taking evidence from the scene, and that's where we find News Channel 5's Joe Paganakis tonight. And Joe, we understand the bomb squad was actually called in today. That's right, Danita. A big part of the FBI's investigation was centering on the homes of, uh, of Mr. Lane's relatives right here on Wilder Road, about three and a half miles from Chardon High School, right here in Chardon Township. Investigators were first at Lane's cousin's home for nearly two hours. The FBI brought in its mobile crime lab as it searched for evidence. Lane's cousins say he hadn't stayed at the home for several years, but he would visit. Investigators also spent two hours at the house next door, according to police. That is Lane's grandparents. Investigators even brought in the Lake County Bomb Squad and an additional evidence truck searching for potential explosives or ammunition. Meanwhile, neighbors who know the suspect, uh, suspect's family were left stunned. It's a great neighborhood. Yeah. But this stuff is everywhere. When we, I think we all know that. No matter how small your community is, drugs, guns, violence, it's everywhere. Now, we know computers were taken from yet another location, another grandparent's home. We believe on Wilson Mills Road, those computers were taken into evidence in this case. Now, coming up on News Channel 5 at 6 o'clock, we'll show you how investigators were across the street here, uh, actually combing through the woods. So this investigation was taking place over numerous acres right here on Wilder Road in Chardon Township. We'll bring you that coming up on News Channel 5 at 6. All right, Joe, thank you very much.